Okay, so this is Dr. Scott Geller, eye floater expert. I've done, I've been doing this a long time, uh, 20 some thousand laser sessions over the years. And we are uh, in the beginning of April, at the end of COVID, we hope, uh, 2021. And I have a great patient here from uh, Naples, Florida. You had bilateral implants done, cataract implants done by a very capable surgeon, yes, a prominent doctor, as we would say. And uh, subsequent that in the right eye, tell us your experience. In the, in the right eye, before a cataract, I didn't have any problems, let's say. Yeah. Okay. After a cataract, is when I got the floaters. In the, right. In the right eye. Yes, that is correct. I did your left eye earlier than that. Right. That was for something slightly different. That was uh, a year, a couple of years before any cataract surgery done elsewhere. Uh, it's very, very common to see patients who've had cataract surgery. Uh, they take out the lens of the eye, which is the size, eh, size of an M and M, more or less and put in a little flat disc we call an intraocular lens implant. That gives the vitreous gel what I would call a little wiggle room and it sort of collapses forward and stuff that was peripheral, in your case, fell right behind the implant. And your vision was almost worse after that, was oh, it yes. not? It was. It was, it was so. worse, especially with reading. Uh, when the pupil is small, this big fuzzball sort of... Uh, came into your visual axis, as we right, say. It was very cloudy in there. Yeah, like. yeah, yeah. So anyway, you've had, uh, I did actually five laser sessions on you, and there's still some persisting. I mean, it's it's an easy thing to undergo this procedure. It's not a vitrectomy. I've never had a retinal detachment. Uh, it's easy for a patient relatively uh, in my hands, and uh, everything's better. Correct. Everything, everything is better. It's and better. I mean, we don't say it's perfect. There's always something to see, but right. uh, you can only push the envelope so far. And you're a happy patient. That's all that counts. I'm happy, and that was an easy procedure. Yeah, no yeah. problem. You're a happy patient. Uh, I probably should send a note to Doctor Sneed. Maybe he'll actually send over send a patient occasionally. Right. Are you following up with him ever? Yes, I do. When? Um, I'm going back. In fact, in in, yeah. in May. Okay, tell them what I did for you. Okay, I will. In fact, maybe I'll send them a note. You're a great patient, and uh, I'll see you after COVID. Okay. Thank you very much.